You may not wish to keep many of the fish that you catch for several reasons. The fish may be too small and under the legal size limit, they may be of a species that is not desirable to eat, or you may catch more fish than you need. If you need to release a fish back into the water, follow these rules. Increasing the size of your hook and fishing with a tight line rather than a slack line will reduce the chances of the fish swallowing the hook. Wet your hands in the water or use a wet cloth before handling a fish so that you do minimal damage to the protective slime and scales on the body of the fish. If you are using a landing net, dip the net into the water for the same reason. If the fish is hooked in the mouth, carefully remove the hook with a pair of long nose pliers to minimise any damage. If the fish has swallowed the hook, cut the line as close to the fish's mouth as possible. Do not attempt to pull it out as this can damage the fish's internal organs. Return the fish to the water as quick as possible. If the fish is tired, hold it by the tail in an upright position in the water and gently move it back and forth for a short time so the water passes through the fish's gills. This will revive the fish and soon it will have enough strength to swim away. If you're fishing from a pier or jetty, you can release your fish back into the water by lowering it down with a bucket and rope. Always use fish-friendly tackles such as knotless enviro nets, circle hooks, and non-lead sinkers. Remember, every fish you release back into the water is a contribution to quality fishing in the future.